Hi everybody, it's Josh from Alternative Brewing. And today we're gonna to be making coffee with the AeroPress Coffee Maker. Now this is such a versatile piece of coffee equipment that there is a ton of ways you can make coffee with it. But today I wanna to share with you how you can make it straight out of the box. So let's dive straight in and get brewing. So there are a heap of accessories that come out of the AeroPress box. But what you also need to start brewing is some way to heat your water. I'm using a Brewista temperature variable kettle and also a way to grind your beans. I've got the Paul X hand grinder here. Now for best results, using freshly roasted coffee beans, grab your scoop, the one that comes out of the box, and get 16 grams of coffee. Now that's about flush with the top of the scoop there. Load up your hand grinder, And for best flavor in the cup, you want to grind to about a medium to fine coarseness. Once it's ground, what you want to do is grab your cap from the AeroPress, placing in a paper filter, lock that into place and place that over your cup. You want to be rinsing a little bit of hot water through the paper filter first. But once that's done, you're ready to start brewing. Place the grounds into the AeroPress. Now you wanna be using around 94 degrees Celsius water or just off the boil. From this point, it shouldn't take more than about two, two and a half minutes to complete the full extraction. So I'm just gonna start pouring the water in there now and start my timer. Filling it all the way to the top. But just leaving a small gap at the top. Give it a gentle agitation. And place the plunger on top. We're gonna wait now to about a minute, a minute and a half before we start plunging. What I also love about the AeroPress is that it's incredibly durable and super portable for that matter. I've made AeroPresses from Machu Picchu all the way up to the Rocky Mountains and I've only ever owned one AeroPress and it's lasted me for years. Once that minute and a minute and a half is done, you want to just gently place pressure down on the plunger and under its own weight, it should start to press down. You want to press all the way to make sure you've gotten all the water out. If you have plunged all the way, then remove the AeroPress off the cup, remove the cap, and you can plunge that straight into the bin or in your compost. And there's your AeroPress coffee. Shouldn't take any more than two, two and a half minutes. I used 16 grams of coffee, to 94 degrees Celsius water, and I finished with a fantastic brew. I hope you like this video. Hit like if you did, throw some comments below and let us know what you're up to in the AeroPress world. Hit subscribe if you like this video, and keep an eye out, we're bringing out new videos each week. See you again next time.